Wait, you mean the guy who designed Cosmos? Yes, but why? He was Xion's boyfriend? But that's a testament! K Kevin! Is it really you? Yes, it's me. What's wrong? Have you forgotten my face? No, I haven't forgotten. I've never once forgotten. But why are you... I've come for you, Xi'an. Kevin, tell me. Why did you hide yourself all this time? Why are you a testament? I needed power. That is why I took this form. But what I look like is not important. It's still me. Nothing has changed. But the Kevin in this time, he sacrificed all those people, all those realians to research the Zohar, even my mother. I had no choice. I'm sorry I made you suffer, but you must understand that it was all done for you. For me? This? Are you saying all of this was for me? It was all for you. I was always thinking about you. Come with me. I need you, Xion. Kevin! Who the hell do you think you are? You've got no right to come here and open up her wounds! And you're saying it's all for her benefit? Silence! This is none of your concern! It sure as hell is my concern! Don't you understand? None of you can save Xion. What do you mean? I hope you can explain yourself. Jean Uzuki. I'm sure you've already realized what's happening to Xion's body. <gasps> That's right. She's suffering from the same illness as her mother. <gasps> Xion, you have an ability that others lack. But that power will eventually cost you your life. That's the reason for your recent headaches. I have the same illness as Mom? If you know that much, then naturally you must know the cause as well. While differing somewhat in the strength of their power, the test subjects assembled in this facility all possess the same ability as Xion. The subjects are capable of communicating with Udu. They can convey their will to Udu. Communicating with Udu? Yes, but that leads to their own death. The test subjects' wills are unable to stand the stress of direct contact with Udu, and they eventually fall into a coma and die. Then why didn't you make them stop the experiments? If you cut off the contact with Udu, wouldn't their illness stop? You don't have to force them to talk with Udu! You can't. Huh? You can't cut off contact with Udu. He's watching us from another realm. You can't run away from him. Udu chooses to make contact? Are you saying those waves have a will? Don't you see, Xi'an? I became a testament to save you. Without this form, without this power, I can't save you. The only ones that can save you are me and Telos. Telos? Telos is gonna save the Chief? Wait a minute, then what the hell is Cosmos? You designed her too! Cosmos is just a prototype built to collect data for Telos, and to monitor Xion. Cosmos is a prototype? Is that why you tried to dispose of her? Yes, Cosmos grew too close to Xion. The source of Cosmos' power comes from Udu, by using the Zohar as a door. Every time Cosmos uses her abilities, Xion, who reacts to Udu, loses her life force. The closer Xion and Cosmos' wills come together, the greater the stress on Xion. 